Hello people, welcome to my YouTube channel, Look Gorgeous, Cook Delicious. As you all know, Maggie is back. Everyone has different style of making their Maggie. It is very simple to make as you all know. I'll be sharing with you how do I make my Maggie Indian style. For the ingredients, I have this one big mug of water. And for the vegetables, I have this uh, half medium onion finely chopped, one beans finely cut one small carrot finely chopped little bit of capsicum finely cut little bit of paneer cubes uh, half a medium tomato finely cut and i've also de-seeded it and two teaspoons of this green peas and also i have one to two teaspoons of clarified butter ghee and one pack of two minute noodles maggie for the spices i'm going to use little bit of turmeric a pinch of turmeric and very little bit uh, around one to two pinches of chili flakes or chili powder and two pinches of salt so i'm adding this clarified butter into the saucepan and now i'm gonna add in the onions i'm gonna fry them for around two to three minutes till they turn golden in color after the onions have turned their color to golden brown i'm now gonna add beans and capsicum and fry them for around a minute and now gonna add in the carrots and fry for another one minute i'm doing it all on medium flame now i'm adding the peas two pinches of salt one and a half pinch of uh, the chili flakes and a pinch of turmeric and now I'm going to mix it well together and turn the flame to sim. These vegetables are looking so beautiful and colourful. And now it is time to add in the water. And after adding in the water, I'm now turn on the flame to high and add in the Maggi noodles. I've added the Maggi noodles after breaking them into four. Cooking it for around two minutes, I'm adding this tomato and paneer cube. It is looking very delicious and colorful. I'm now turning the flame to sim for two minutes. This Maggi is about to get done, so I'm adding in the Maggi masala. I'm adding it at about last because so that the flavor and spices are well into it. Mix it well, and I'm now switching on the flame to high, turning on the flame to high. Sorry. I'll cook it for 1-2 minutes more till the water is evaporated. When your maggi is about to get done, I'm going to add 1 teaspoon of this clarified butter for very enhanced and tasty flavor. Here is the beautiful, delicious, colorful maggi ready. If it helped you and if you like my video, then please stay tuned to my channel for more simple and easy recipes like this and for much more. Stay blessed, look gorgeous, cook delicious. Love you all.